over Southwest Florida are showing their support for Childhood Cancer Awareness Month. Tomorrow, people will be getting their heads shaved at Golisano's Children's Hospital as a way to raise awareness for such a good cause. Catherine Marsh is alive with a survivor who will be doing some of the head shaving. Catherine, tell us all about it. That's right, Lauren and Jane. Joining me this morning is CAO Armando and, of course, the beautiful Mackenzie. You're 19 years old, right? Yes. You're 19 years old. You inspired Armando to put some fun into a fundraiser, get some people out, get the community out to really raise awareness for Childhood Cancer Awareness Month. You know, why did you do that? Um, I don't know. Because you're awesome? Yeah. yeah. Tell us a little bit about yourself. Mm. What do you like to do? I like to sew. I like um, reading. I like playing cards. <laughs> You're probably pretty good at playing cards, aren't you? I can tell. Yeah. You're very smart. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very cool. All right, Armando, this whole event going on tomorrow, you're getting the community involved to really raise awareness for a good cause. Tell us all about it. So I um, met Mackenzie uh, several weeks back. Her parents came to have lunch with me, and they just wanted to tell their story, talk about their journey. And I was so moved by her and so touched by her. She's being shy on camera, but she teaches <laughs> Sunday school. She's an amazing young lady. And look at that smile. How could you not love her? It really is contagious. It really is. And so I, I said, there's got to be a way to connect in a meaningful manner and get the message out. Um, the journey these children are on takes so much courage, and she's so strong. And so I wanted to honor her, and I thought, what better than having her shave my head? And so I told a couple of friends who said, you know what, we'll do it with you. And it was just going to be a little Lee Health thing. And then people in the community found out, and now it's turned into like an extravaganza. I think 30 people are having their head shaved tomorrow. And we're just so like proud of the community, how it's coming together. We're proud of Mackenzie and how strong she is. And we're really hoping for some amazing stuff tomorrow. Sounds good. I have to ask you finally, are you excited to shave Armando's head? Yes. How excited are you? I'm pretty excited, yeah. yeah. That'll be fun. All right, sounds good. Thank you so much, Mackenzie and Armando. We'll toss it back to you guys. We're live in Fort Myers. Catherine Marsh, Fox 4, in your corner. Great cause. And you know what? One of those people who's getting our, their head shaved, our very own Patrick Nolan. He'll get it shaved tomorrow by a pediatric cancer patient at Gali Sano Children's Hospital. He'll be along uh, dozens others of uh, important community mem members. They're all raising money for Barbara's Friends, which is Gali Sano's cancer fund. All the details are on fox4now.com. So enjoy scruffy Patrick Nolan for a little while longer.